What do you see in the Nicole? Uh, it's hard to describe it. It's really dirty and it will better have a look in. I see, yeah. Mm-hmm. Where? Off of Martell. Do you like dig for it or do you just find it or just can give it to you? I found it. It's weird. Next to the railroad tracks. It's bad. Mm-hmm. There's holes in its head. What do you think that shape could mean? Look at that. I bet Mom's got an idea. Mom, what do you think that shape could be? No shape? Mm -hmm. Like, what kind of animal do you think it would represent? I don't know. I mean, I'm sure that looks like red plates of a skull feeds together. You want to use this? No. Take them. One kind of looks like a hand right there, Mom. Does See it? that? But it has three fingers and one thumb. Oh, Dad, the animal could have been sick when it died. Could have been, yeah. So we need to be really careful with that, don't we? I think all the germs from it's being sick would be off of it by now. Oh. I think it's been outside for a long, long time. Dad, look. See, see, what is that? It looks like a hole. Yeah, but wait. What do you think went in there? Don't know. It's teeth to help us find out. Yeah, I think if we knew more about its teeth, we'd be able to know what it was for sure. They kind of look like some coyotes or something, but the eyes are way too big, right? I don't know. That was kind of some of my first thinking, too. Is that it did look a little bit like a coyote, but I don't think coyotes have eyes that big, but maybe they do. If you look carefully, you can see that the teeth have have like kind of certain walks. Yeah. So really carefully. How you many teeth does it have? I don't know. Do you think this was all its teeth or do you think it had more? It has to have top teeth. Top teeth. Well, I think these are the top teeth. I mean, do you think that the teeth came further out here? Think some broke off, maybe? Do you think that's it? I'm kind of confused about that question. Something that I can't go with. Hmm. I don't know. No. But, Dad, you should look closely. Oh, and there's, see all those certain shapes and lumps? On the teeth? Yeah. Mm hmm. Is that how you're studying it? Yeah. Like through the camera? Mm hmm. They have little certain, certain lumps. Look at that hole. Where? Can you show me on the skull? Look, it might be there, but... Oh. Yup. So, what hole do you think that was? I don't know. Prop, here, how about we study the shape in, of the size on it? It's round, right? Mm-hmm. And what size is it? <coughs> I think it's about, a, about an inch in diameter. If you look at it through life, it looks a little bigger. If I look at it through life? Uh, wait. So, take it away a little bit. Um, hmm, maybe about that far. That's how real, maybe a little, about that big. Oh, yes. So, it's kind of big, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Oh, I just some something 
some interesting, interesting, interesting holes. Look, right there and there. Hmm. Pretty interesting, aren't they? They are, you're right. Who? Oh, I got an idea what, what these stuff, what these might be. Yeah? Where are the ears wore? You think so? Yeah, do you think I had, do you think I'd maybe right? Can you point at it again? I think these may be where the ears are. Like you're, you know, or at least in the right general area. Yeah. Sometimes they're a little on top. Or... Oh, yeah. If you look back here, you can see it has certain shapes and lumps there, too. They're... Do they tell you what kind of animal it was? No. Doesn't. Dad. Mm hmm If we study the neck a little more and the teeth a little more, or we could maybe find out. So wolf, fox, and coyote, you think it was? It might be just wolf, fox, or fox, or wolf, or coyote, but I don't, these, that's my best guess. Ooh, ooh, ooh. See that hole? Yes. You should bend it a little closer so you can see it better. Oh yeah, that hole is kind of cu interesting, curiously. Right. It interests me. What are you doing with that? Getting it to focus. Oh, trying to get it this for a little more bit of focus. Yeah. Yeah, it kind of does look weird. Let's let's look at it a little through life. Should we look at it through life? What do you mean through life? Like th without through there? Sure. That is curious. Oh, Mom, we have a pretty tricky hole right here that we're going to need a little of your help to figure out. Really. Yeah, it's really small. Like it isn't really a hole, but there's, but there's a hole right here behind it. We're interested in it. Or like, oh dad, did you realize behind it, it's a hole. Another hole? Yeah, yeah, but this isn't really a hole, it's just there's a teeny crack. There's a bit of question here. This could help us figure out the size of the eye. They're about the same size, right? Mm-hmm. And so, how big is this rock? I don't know, about two inches in diameter. Hmm. So the eye is about two inches in diameter. And maybe the teeth are about maybe the teeth were probably about mm, maybe like you know wolves and coyotes are like how how animals have like teeth really long teeth teeth but skinny and sharp like a like a like a like this like this mm -hmm. but not as long it might pro maybe as sharp as those that look 
there's something we definitely do need to know. We need to know the sharp of the teeth, how the brain works, and about the size of, and about where the eyes look. Those are some certain stuff that can help us. Most mm -hmm. of all, the brain, right? Maybe we should send texture and the text beside the picture to one to a friend that that has told you all the rest of your skulls. Say, what is this skull? What is this animal? I asked our friends on Facebook. We'll see if someone there knows. Maybe you should go back and look. Yeah. Oh. Hold on. Look. You look on here. Mm-hmm. Do you think that that is where the teeth can act? Kind of looks like it, huh? I bet that's one thing that helps us figure out math, right? Definitely. So we have, we know one thing for sure, right? What's that? The teeth. That and the, this, right? That the teeth connect? Yeah. Yeah. Those little lumps there. My belly hurts.